Really, uh, interesting place you've got here, huh? Homie. What do you want? Oh, well, uh, the team just wanted to see if there was anything in particular you wanted. You know, figured it was a good idea to keep you happy. Only because that keeps us happy. We are definitely not wanting anything in return. <laughs> anything you'd like added to catering? Uh, anything to spruce up your, um, lair here? A particular opponent you'd like to face? Bring me a sacrifice. Excuse me? Any opponent who faces me is doomed. A sacrifice. Oh, okay. <laughs> a sacrifice. Got it. <laughs> okay. I'll set it up. I might be seeing things, but it looks like the captain is pretty worn down. I wouldn't trust that, Saxon. I bet she's coiled up like a snake, ready to strike. She does look tired, though. I guess harnessing supernatural powers over a period of time will do that to someone. Who knows? Ooh. Oh, Nikki Cross manages the counter. Oh, and a reversal. Ah, oh, look at this! Hair pulled net slam! And Cross gets stonewalled! Eat the feet! Oh! Well placed kick! She's taking some big hits here! This is not going to end well. Exploder! Ooh. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. Agility like that, easier said than done, gentlemen. Oh, man. Over the top to the floor she goes. Look out. There she comes. Tope Suicida like a heat-seeking missile hit the target right on the mark. Awesome. Awesome. Toss back into the ring. shooting star showing off the quickness that'll turn things around in a hurry oh. and Nikki Cross is on the downside of things yeah Cross needs to come up with a new plan fast she saw it coming Super kick. good night connects the fist to the face great counter getting set up for something in the corner from the middle row Planning them with that DDT there. Oh, crap. Oh, the impact on that clothesline. And there's another one. Oh, caught the kick. Intercepted. Nice sweep of the leg. A straight jacket. What are they looking to do here? Into a neck breaker. She thinks she has it. She kicks out with authority. She is still very much in this. She's fighting back. Here we go. Bang! What a move. We might be close to the end. Yeah, she is not looking good right now. Fighting death. 
desperately. She rolls her way out of the submission and takes control. Time to go for a ride. Oh, an exploder suplex. Power of the soul siphon. Byron, you okay for this? You know this move makes me want to run, Corey. Nikki Cross suffers defeat. Losing like this would demoralize a normal superstar, but lucky for Nikki, she's far from normal. Only in WWE will you get a match not just between athletes, but between opposing supernatural forces. And there's been a dark force that's always played a part in the WWE Universe, and I think we're seeing a battle for that power tonight. I don't know if either Asuka or Cap can eventually wield the power, but I know it can only be one of them. And that was an effective attack, guys. All the way up. Uh-oh, looking to platter with a DDT. Planted face first. 
first. Anything Asuka is trying is being suppressed. This has to be a bit demoralizing for the Empress. They drop back. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. And now gets tossed into the ring. Oh, man, that was nasty. Pulls the ripcord. Knee strike to the face. She's forced onto the defensive now. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. Goodness. Somersault reverse DDT. And her resolve's looking unsteady here. This is where her grit will be put to the test. These two trade encounters, an absolute master class. Ataxia. Kick to the gut. I have a theory what's coming next. Face plant. Boom. Attempt to strike here, but Asuka counters with the spin kick. She's invoking the soul siphon. If Cap's got her in her grasp, there's no hope for Asuka now. Wait, is Asuka trying to fight? Asuka's doing more than fighting it. She's using the same power against her. Is this really happening? Get on board, Saxton. The real question is, who's more powerful? And Asuka's down. Asuka was foolish to try something that Cap has already perfected. Does that even count as a pin? She's not even touching Asuka. I guess it counted because it's over. You know, that's not the spirit of the rule. Neither is floating an opponent during a match. Uh, Michael, back me up here. Guys, when you've been around here as long as I have, you learn not to question these things. Oh, my. They're both down. Is this even something medical can help with? If I were them, I'd stay far away from whatever's happening. Look who decided to wake up. Where am I? Trainer's room. You passed out in the ring. I don't understand. I defeated Asuka. All of the amulet's power that escaped should have come back to me. That's what I was trying to tell you. The amulet didn't disappear because its power was going to you and Asuka. It disappeared because you both had fed it enough to unleash the creature. What? That's where the power is now. Haven't you noticed? I have felt a bit weaker lately. You were only a vessel, a way for the creature to rebuild its strength until it was ready to break free. Now, you know how sometimes people have to fight their metaphorical demons in this business? I think this time, you might have to fight yours. Literally. That is, if you can. I'm ready. I actually feel more like myself than I have in a long time. I hope so. I don't think you'll have all the powers you've been using lately to take this on. You'll need to draw on everything else you've got inside you to defeat the darkness you unleashed. I thought we had seen it all, but now this? Do we really have to stay and call this match? They say the safest place to be during a creepy supernatural match is yeah. right at ringside. Who says that, Cole? I just made it up to make Byron feel better. Did it work? No. They drop bang! <laughs> outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. She's looking for something under the ring to even her odds here. Oh boy, she went shopping and she saw smart, grabbing her own form of a boomstick. Into the ring now. Bam! 
She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. This one is headed outside, guys. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Oh, hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. And things are just going from bad to worse. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. This doesn't even look like trying to win a match anymore. This looks like trying to end someone's career. This is getting more and more alarming with each uninterrupted attack. She saw that one coming. Able to sidestep it. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. This superstar thinking. They're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. Reversal. What a counter. Uh-oh. This is just vicious. Stop in the arm. Oh, elbow right to the bread basket for their troubles. She turns it right around with a counter. She's staying elusive. Oh. Connecting on the DDT. And manifestation got tested there. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Looking for something, anything under the ring. She's got a chair, and her opponent is in her sights. Fends off the attack with an elbow. Kick right to the face. Here it comes. Oh, tuck her in. It's bedtime. Is it enough? The cover. Well, we don't really know what that was, but it's over. It's looking like not only a victory, but the beginning of a new chapter for the cap and maybe the end of an old one that was a different woman in the ring than we've seen the past few weeks what now it's gone and i thought i had no clue what was going on before you know what i give hop